Hi, this is Leanne with uh, at the Crochet Gotta Love It blog, crochetgottalovit.blogspot.com. Today I'm demonstrating on how to make a large curlicue on the curlicues doily, which I'm currently working on, as follows. I have my two helpers here to help me film. I've got a microphone man and a cameraman, my two sons, Patrick and John. Anyway, single crochet in the top of that shell. Chain 14, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Okay, you're going to work four doubles in each chain across, starting with the fourth chain from your hook. So 1, 2, 3, 4. And as you work, this curly cue is going to start curling on its own naturally. Just allow it to do that. It gives it a much nicer shape to the overall finished look of the curly cue. You can flatten it out if you want by doing this, just so you can see your stitches. But you'll have to manually retwist it at the end. It just doesn't look as good. So just allow it to kind of naturally curl and just look around the stitches as you work. You just peep around the back of the stitch, um, this roll that's starting to form here. Okay, I'll tell you when to start it. <clears throat> and it'll just save on bike counts and stuff. Okay, I'm going to do one more chain stitch here, second. Okay, you can restart it. Okay. I have two chains left to work in, so we're going to do four chains in the, I mean four doubles in that second to last chain. And four doubles in this last chain. And see how this curly cue has taken a shape of its own? This is what we want. And you just kind of look around the um, roll it forms. Okay, so you chain four. You single crochet in the next single crochet. Make a piku stitch, chain three. Slip stitch in the side of that single and chain another four and work a single crochet in the top of your next shell and do another large curly cue from there. I'm using a Hamanaka, the size 3 slash 0 hook, fabulous hooks, um, wouldn't trade them for the world. Anyway, this is Leanne signing off. Have a good day. Be sure to stop by and visit. Leave a comment at crochet, gotta love it, dot blogspot, dot com. Thank you very much.